All right, in this part three of this series on the new Google Forms, let's take a little bit of time and show you how to um, edit your form, to how to add some things like uh, images and uh, change up the look of your form. Just a reminder, if one of the overall looks, if you go up to the palette right here and you click that, you can completely change the look. Let's say I want to go more with the blue here. One click and it's done. Uh, one of the most common things that you'll need to do when you create a form, first of all, let's go back to questions because I was on the responses. The, one of the most common things that you'll need to do is perhaps you want to reorder the questions on your form. So for example, let's say you want to have the name question go after the kind of food. If you notice if I hover over each question, you get these little bars here, little six, little six uh, circles and you get the little four-pronged arrow. If I wanted to shape, shift this up, all I have to do is click and drag, and it will move it up top. And then if I scroll down, you can see that the name is down here. Now, if I want to move it back, I'm just going to go ahead and drag it back up. So it's completely easy to um, shift the order of the questions. Now, let's say you wanted to put a picture or a video into your form. So for example, I'm going to go ahead and scroll down here and I like how this kind of comes, comes with me and I want to put a picture. So I'm going to click the add image and I'm going to choose an image that I've already downloaded. I've got a Twitter logo. Let's say I want to put a question about, I want people to submit their Twitter handle in the form. So you can see I, it has put this gigantic Twitter logo. So let's say I'm going to put Twitter handle. And, but I don't want this picture to be this big. No problem. Click it. Come up to the corner. Click and drag. And you can make that as large or as small as you would like. So let's say I'm going to make it look about that big. You can center the picture, right justify. I'm going to go ahead and keep it left justify. And I'm done with that. And now I want to put a question about that. So I'm going to go ahead and add a question. And notice it put it right underneath that. I'm going to make this, uh, what is your Twitter handle? And I'm going to put that little, remember, I'm going to put a little hint text. And I'm going to put, please begin with the at sign. And I don't want that to be a multiple choice question. Once again, I'm going to make that a short answer question. Just so you know, if you did a paragraph, it gives you a, long, a longer area to enter your answer. But I'm going to do a short answer. I'm going to make that, uh, I'm not going to make that required because perhaps somebody doesn't have a Twitter account. And, but now I don't want that to be first. I want, I want the name, but then I want the food. So I'm going to go ahead and come back here, drag this up so it's underneath the name, and then I'm going to let it go. So now you can see name, food. Now I have a nice picture, and then the Twitter handle. And if I don't want to have that, I could actually get rid of that title. You could do the same type of thing with a video. You could insert a video here, and then perhaps ask a question about the video. This would be a great way to perhaps make a little quiz for your students. Have them watch a video, have them in, uh, input a multiple choice question about the video. So once again, those are a few ways that you can spruce up your Google form by adding pictures, images, uh, pictures, videos, uh, reorder the questions, and even change the color of the overall form.